Okay, so we're gonna talk about the always-on display. Now, if you're familiar with the Galaxy S7 or the LG G5, they have the um, always-on display. But now there's an app for all Androids, or actually most Androids, now you're able to use the always-on display simply by downloading an app. And I'm gonna show you a little bit about this one here. It's actually called always-on display. But if you have the phone in your pocket or your purse, you can see that the entire screen will turn off. So you can see here. Now the great thing about like this 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 uh, this always on display app that you can download is this. You can to brighten your entire um, display. What you can do is a double tap, double tap, double tap. Now the S7, you cannot do that. Okay, so this is. I mean, if you're familiar with, you know, if you had your phones long enough, you know, there's, there's times where it's very possible your, your home button can break or your power button. So this is a great feature. You just simply just double tap. And let me go ahead and go in here and I can show you. We'll go to the Play Store here. And it's actually called Always On Display from S7 as well as the uh, LG, the G5. That's what the icon looks like. And if I open it up, and you can see... Now there's only four themes on here, but you know it's a new app, so eventually they're gonna. I mean, probably very very soon, within a couple weeks or so, they're gonna come in with a lot of other templates. But you can see, let me just go back here, and we'll go to uh, clock setup here, and I'm gonna click on down. So there's only four themes here. You have digital, uh, gear S2, calendar, and the Galaxy S7 clock. And also, what you can do too is let me go back here. You can go into notification settings here and you can show your notifications and you can even show your notification contents as well. And of course, you can rearrange or uh, resize your uh, font, your, um, you can change the colors and you can change the width and the height of the actual clock as well. You do have another, um, you have another clock setting here which is a, so you can show the calendar as well so this is what it pretty much this is what three of the uh, ones look like here let me turn that off so this is pretty much what it looks like you see these ones here I do have the notification on here this one I turned turned it off completely so that's pretty much it if you guys have any questions or anything just comment below all right thanks bye